Mississippians have voted overwhelmingly in favor of Initiative 65, which makes medical marijuana illegal here in the state of Mississippi. Nearly three quarters of voters uh, were in uh, favor of the measure. 12 News' Tal Tal breaks down what it, this means for the Magnolia State moving forward. Tal? Byron, that's right. Activists breathing a sigh of relief after voters approved Initiative 65 by a 74% majority that will allow doctors to prescribe medical marijuana for 22 debilitating conditions. Now, Mississippi is one of five states that legalized cannabis yesterday, marking another historic election for cannabis policy reform. The Mississippi Department of Health will now begin drafting and putting in place the rules and regulations, which has to be completed by July 2021, and then by August, medical marijuana patient cards will then be issued. The proposal proposal allows patients with debilitating medical conditions to legally obtain medical marijuana after getting a doctor's recommendation. It includes at least two dozen qualifying conditions such as cancer, chronic pain, and post-traumatic stress disorder, allowing patients to buy 2.5 ounces of marijuana per 14-day period. Jamie Grantham is with Mississippians for Compassionate Care, a strong advocate for Initiative 65 for at least two and a half years. Take a listen. Honestly, I'm just I am super humbled to have been able to be part of this um, because it's so meaningful to so many people across Mississippi. And does not come without its challenges. The mayor of Madison is asking the state Supreme Court to invalidate the cannabis measure because she says they were unlawfully placed before voters. Now, as of now, the Secretary of State has two days left to respond. We have reached out to Governor Reeves' office and I've yet to hear back. Baron, back to you.